Okay, walking in the square and I found this particular one, the historical Kumkapi restaurant in the square. And I'm gonna go in there, enjoy the meal, and then I'll let you know what it was like. The chap's already outside. He's invited me in. Let me get this round. Invited me in. And what's the name of the square again? Pasha. Pasha Square. Yeah. Pasha Square Historical Kumkapi Restaurant. And that's where we're gonna. And the other chap is over there. It's the he, part, yeah. I was walking past, and all the people stopped me. And then he came along, and his smile from his face persuaded me to come into this restaurant. So I'm gonna go and enjoy his food. Let me see what his food is like. So I've come into another restaurant, a traditional Turkish restaurant. Mainly does fish, uh, sea bass, and various other fish. I'm gonna try and select something from the menu. Let's see what the menu's got. Um, as I was walking past, there's about 60 other restaurants down here. Everybody's saying, come to my restaurant, come to my restaurant. So <laughs> I did. Um, I spoke to this chap, he was a bit funny, so I thought, well, okay, we'll jump into his restaurant. Uh, first thing he did is come down, his mind is the best restaurant, I'm gonna give you the best seat. I'm gonna... It's all right, it's a nice restaurant. Um, give you a little glimpse of the restaurant and the menu, one second. Yeah, that's the menu. It looks nice. Yeah, so I'll probably get some sea bass. Uh, this is how it's supposed to look. So I'm gonna see, it actually looks when the when the order comes to see whether it is uh, how it is on the uh, menu. Various things, loads and loads of things on the menu. But um, I'll choose something and then let's see what it tastes like. So it's a nice restaurant and seating area. They've got the nice seats and the tables with flowers on it. It's all laid out. Gonna, they've actually got a bar area here as well. So we're gonna go and see if the sh chef is making anything. Okay. So I'm gonna walk into the kitchen area and they've got all these appetizers ready, mussels, vegetables, seafood, seafood cold, warm, and they've got the chilies. Uh, I have a nice time in this restaurant. Let's go inside to the kitchen, let's have a look. It's in the kitchen, in the kitchen, They've got all the vegetables. Salam, brother. Alaikum salam. Top chef. Yes. yes. Chef, chef. Yes, chef. Yeah. Another chef there as well. Master, yeah. chef. Master chef is sitting behind there, and he's gonna make. Tuna fish. Tuna fish. Okay, that is tuna fish. Yeah. Okay. So when he's making, come back in here to see how he's preparing this meal, and then we're gonna look at it, taste it, and give him a review out of ten. So, so all the vegetables, the fresh, everything there. You can see they got the peppers, the chilies, the cucumbers. All right. What I'm going to do, my order, and then see this guy. He's the top man. What's your name? Pasha. Pasha. Yeah. What's your name? Hussein. Say Hussein. And the other brother? Kamran Khan. Kamran Khan. Where are you from? Pashtuni. Pashtuni. I met a Pathan in Turkey. Can you believe it? A Pashtun brother in uh, Turkey. First Pashtun I've come across in Turkey, yeah? And then the other brother, what's your name? Musa. 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 And yours? Anwar. Anwar. Russian. Russian. Yeah. I know a bit of Russian, but I forgot it. So I'll, I'll tell you when I remember it, I speak to you in Russian. <laughs> and for the chef to make the food, and then I'm going to record it for you. And then you like, tell me in the comments, did it look like the menu or it didn't look like the menu? And I'll give you a review out of 10 for this restaurant. Name of the restaurant again? Historical. Historical and the name of the area? Kupkape. Kupkape area. So if you're passing by, make sure you come and see this guy. So another brother I've met from there, Namke? My name is Raja. Asif Raja from Azad Kashmir, Pakistan. Idar kitna sal ho aapka? Idar... Uh, ho gaya. Ho gaya. Ka, uh, ka ka ye kaam karega ka ye kaam karega ye kaam karega ye kaam karega ye kaam karega aur matlab ye hai ke guzara wala alhamdulillah alhamdulillah bahut acha guzara ho raha hai okay family bhi idhar nahi family bhi 
बहुत अच्छा माशाल्लाह बहुत अच्छा बहुत अच्छा बाकी तो मुझे नहीं पता बारह जिस होटल पे रेस्टोरेंट पे हम काम कर रहे हैं माशाल्लाह बहुत अच्छा काम है इसमें कोई किसी किसी की प्रॉब्लम ये ठीक है ठीक है और ये अभी रेस्टोरेंट क्वाइट है नहीं अभी क्वाइट है सीजन नहीं है क्या ये सीजन नहीं है सीजन नहीं है कुछ सर्दी भी बहुत ज्यादा है ओके जरे की वजह से भी कुछ मुतासर है इस वजह से इधर सही बात है सही बात और जनाब वो पश्चू की खबर है कमरान खान कमरान खान ओ ये So they bought me some olives in um, olive oil and some um, hummus with some. T There's the hummus, <coughs> olives in oil. I've never tasted that before. Never had that in. I've had olives, but not in the olive oil with some crunchy bread. I must say, it's tasty so far. Let's see what the sea bass is like. I've ordered the sea bass with some vegetables. Um, I've asked it to make it spicy. So hopefully it'll come out nice. Let's have a look. But it's a nice restaurant so far. So my fish is getting ready. And my fish is the grill. Yeah, he's turned it over. It looks fabulous. Yeah, the master chef has done it for me. And he's got the display, the salad, the lemon, the onion, the tomato. He's put everything on it and here's another chap. Yes, I'm from Pakistan. Pakistan, where yes, about? Uh, Kashmir. Kashmir? Yes. Okay, you enjoy yourself in Turkey? Yes, of course. Your I English is very good. Oh, thank you very much. You will studied English here? Or? Yes, yes. I'm uh, in uh, English uh, uh, political science in M. Mashallah, very good, very good. So, in Tani Brothers, uh, but anyway, I'll speak to this guy later. My food is getting cold and I'm hungry. Yeah. So I'm going to go and have my food and then I'll speak to these chaps in a bit. Yes. Food for uh, our customer. Okay. Uh, and uh, he's very co too much cooperative. So in effect, he puts a lot of effort into the work and he's cooking yes. and into the business itself. Are you involved with this business? Uh, no, I'm a... Uh, uh, Bread maker okay. and tea maker. Okay, mashallah. Yes. But you're saying the chef yes. is a hard working person yes. and he does everything. Let yes. me just take a quick picture and of him there with the with the food that he's got. Yes. Right? Enjoy. Anyway, I'm gonna go and enjoy my meal. Yeah. Right? And my meal, I will have a chat with you okay, later on. You okay? So Let's go. So I'm back at my table and my food has arrived. I've just in the kitchen with them. I'm going to show you the food. It is exactly as it was on the menu. Yeah, so let me have a just quick turn around for it. That's what it is. It looks beautiful. And I just hope it tastes beautiful, but let's have a look. I'm going to give it a, try, a taste uh, and see what the fish is like. I can't do the camera and that together. So what I'm going to do, uh, see if I can try and put this on a stand. So just turn it around. Bass. One of the best sea bass I've had in the whole world. It's tasty, especially with the lemon on it. Gotta give the guy a good rating. Let me eat it all, see what it comes out like after I've tasted it, and then I'll let you know. So I've had my meal. I 
I think it's one of the creamiest sea basses I've ever eaten. You're gonna have to need to see my plate to see what happened, what got left behind. I don't normally leave things behind. Anyway, the food was too good. The sea bass was creamy, it was nice. The texture to it was really good and the taste was really good. And on top of everything, they had this chili oil, which they put on top. Let me just show you. That's the sea bass. Chili oil. Yeah? So the only with the bones, probably can have a cup of tea. And if you're passing by, the name's on the screen. You need to come and see this place in Istanbul. It's a must. 10 out of 10 for the sea bass. So on top of the fish, I asked the guy for the bill. He brings me this on top. It's halwa with fruit, fruit and um, apple, grapes. Um, there's a halwa in the middle and I just tasted that. Halva there, I've never seen this in the in Turkey, yeah, but it's magnificent on top of the food as a bonus. And I think they're saying some uh, Turkish tea they're going to bring, so I'll try that and then I'm tired for the evening. I've had a fantastic evening meal, and my apple tea has arrived as well. So let's, apple tea. gorgeous that's gonna bring my evening to an end hope you've enjoyed the video like share it subscribe it put a comment on it and if you've been to this place before the historical restaurant uh, put a comment in the box to say how you felt how were you treated I think it was a 10 out of 10 service not only by the staff but the food was fantastic as well yeah one last point if you're curious, it came to £9.98. pence. Sea bass, fruit, tea, deal.